Thank you for joining us for episode three. This episode is especially for anyone who has been called a perfectionist or anyone that struggles with control. And really, who doesn't struggle with control these days? My friend introduced this concept to me a few years ago, and she said, you have to read this book. The book was called Wabi Sabi for Artists, Designers, Poets, and Philosophers by Leonard Corin. And this book changed my life. So what is Wabi Sabi? Wabi Sabi comes from traditional Japanese aesthetics and the way that I always think about it is it's just finding beauty in imperfection. So here's some Wabi Sabi inspired words to help you get started. Temporary, raw, unfinished, rough, simple, organic. And here's a quote from that book. Beauty can spontaneously occur at any moment given the proper circumstances, context, or point of view. Beauty is thus an altered state of consciousness, an extraordinary moment of poetry and grace. So here's a really fun and quick exercise to help you find that inner wabi-sabi. Here's what you'll need. One piece of paper, preferably watercolor paper, a thick brush, or a set of brushes, some black ink, a timer, and yes, you can use the one on your cell phone, a spray bottle, and a bowl of water. So you'll have one minute to make 12 different strokes on that piece of paper. And when the time's up, that's your final piece of work. As you begin this exercise, just remember to take a deep breath. <sighs> Turn on some relaxing music and let go of this idea of perfect. As of culture, we become obsessed with perfection. We're ashamed of our curves, our wrinkles, and anything else that we consider imperfect. But what if instead of criticizing all these things and trying to fit into some mold, we celebrated these instead? What if we realized these things make us human and these things are what true beauty really is? When the timer goes off, consider your work done, no matter where you are. And let this be your moment to just step back and embrace all the things that came up and maybe just study it for all those little moments that you could have never planned. So here's your new mantra. Say it with me now. Wabi-sabi. Thank you so much for watching and the light in me sees and honors the light in you. Namaste.